2018 Chevrolet Camaro ZL11 Liter E. Chevy cut no corners with the ZL11 Liter E, but it surely climbed plenty of curbs. Overview. Track tuned and ready to rumble, the ZL1 is king of the muscle cars, earning a 10 Best Cars Award for 2018. Both the coupe and the convertible house a ferocious 650 horsepower supercharged 6.2 liter V8 donated by the Corvette Z06. Power is sent to the rear through either a 6 speed manual or a 10 speed automatic and an electronic limited slip differential, then scorches the pavement via ultra wide rear tires. An 8.0 inch infotainment display is standard, a performance data recorder is optional. General Motors must have authorized overtime for its performance and badge making departments over the past few years. Witness the sustained, affordable excellence of all those SS, 1 the, Z51, Z06, Z07, ZR1, ZL1, and Cadillac V Series models the corporation keeps cranking out. Now comes a car that combines two of those GM speak codes, ZL1 and 1 the, but the sticker price doesn't seem to cover the sum of the parts. The ZL11 liter e enhancements stretch the Camaro's performance envelope like a balloon ready to pop. Never mind the Corvette Z06-derived Del T4 supercharged 6.2-liter V8 that is good for 650 horsepower and 650 pound-feet of torque. Or the functional carbon fiber wing, a first for GM production cars, designed in a Formula One wind tunnel. The wing has the same effect as 300 pounds of lead ballast at 150 miles per hour or the gaping front end that swallows 106 cubic feet more air per minute than a regular ZL1 at 87 miles per hour or the chin splitter and dive planes on the cheeks. Instead, for just a moment, fixate on our measurement of the Camaro's maximum lateral acceleration, 1.18 grams. That kind of steady state grip puts the one line in a lead group. Indeed. There's only one car we've measured with more stick and that's the Corvette Z06 equipped with the Z07 package, 1.19 grams. Everything else lets go sooner, period.